<laughs> we want to abolish ice, abolish cow farts, abolish kids. Welcome back to the show, guys. I'm your host, Valentine. Expecting you guys are having a wonderful and blessed day. Thank you so much for being one more week with me again. Thank you for the people who are subscribing, the people that are giving me comments. Thank you for the feedback. Thank you for everything. Let's get right into it right away. On today's show, we're going to be talking about AOC, all out crazy. I mean, uh, uh, Alexander Casio Cortez can't have babies anymore. And we're also going to be talking about an ex porn star that's given advice to the Democrats. This is this is where we're at in 2019. Yes, an ex porn star. That's right. Has more moral value than some of the people making laws for us in the Senate. Jenna Jameson. For you guys that don't know, yeah, that, that name might sound familiar. Uh, that's, she's an ex-porn star who's given advice to the Democrats. Yep, that's right. That's where we're at in 2019. Ex-porn stars giving advice to Democrats. On Monday, a bill was introduced into the Senate where uh, it was called the Born Alive Abortion Survivors Protection Act, which protected babies who were born alive in late-term abortions. Perfect. That makes perfect sense to me. But... Some Democrats decided that was a bad idea. We have to kill the babies. We can't because the baby's born. The baby doesn't have any, 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 uh, what you call it, any rights, right? Or anything like that. Because this is what they believe that the, um, a baby inside the belly doesn't have any rights. And now they want to take it even more, which is outside the womb. They don't have any rights either. And that's why they didn't vote for, for this bill. Jenna Jameson tweets out that these people are monsters or something like that in regards to like 44 Democrats who voted against this bill to protect babies once they were born in botched abortion. So we have some of the, you know, some of the main runners for the Democratic Party for actually the presidential runner for the Democrat, uh, Democratic Party now, which some of them, which are Cory Booker, Kirsten Gillibrand, Mika Maller Harris, whose father publicly Jamaican father, that's why I do that accent. Jamaican father publicly almost like denounced her. She must be a bad daughter, to be honest. If your father comes out publicly to say that you uh, are using uh, what, what, what he said, um, identity politics, when, when she said she was smoking weed and that she's Jamaican and of course she smokes weed, her father came out against her, right? So we got Kamala Harris, the Bernie Sanders. We got Elizabeth Warren, right? All these people uh, didn't sign that bill because they didn't want to protect babies. Just plain and simple. So we have Jenna Jameson, a porn star, guys, an ex-porn star, for God's sake, coming out and telling these Democrats that they're evil for not protecting these kids when they are born. Well, this is this is what the Democratic has become. It's a party of abortion. What did you expect, Jenna Jameson? I mean, you know what I'm saying? Guys. What you guys think about this, man? Because this is just insanity, man. Where, where, where is America headed? Some people say, if I'm not mistaken, that the greatest sin of America, which America has many sins, many, many. Trust me, we are not an innocent nation. And and if you're, if you are, what, what you call it? If you're a real person, if you're a logical person, you will acknowledge that, right? We're not perfect. Nobody is perfect. You're not perfect. I'm not perfect. There's no perfect nation. Out of the many sins that America has, the sin of abortion is the worst one. We have about like 60 million, I think. Marco Rubio tweeted the other day that we have 60 million abortions since Roe v. Wade. And now we want to protect even more than abortion. Now we want to protect infanticide. Uh, all out crazy. AOC. <laughs> I heard that on, on, on Curtis, Curtis Lee, well, you know, uh, from the Guardian Angels on the radio caller, AOC, all out crazy. I mean, that's what it's seeming, man. And so it's basically like there's scientific consensus that the lives of children are gonna be very difficult. And it does lead, I think, young people to have a legitimate question. You know, should, is it okay to still have children? This woman, as you guys saw there, can somebody, but, but first of all, before I get into it, what is the deal with, with, with doing these, 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 recording these videos on, on your, on your, on your, thing on your kitchen and while you're cooking I, I don't understand am i gonna have to start doing this so i could get some subs and i don't know if you guys noticed but she has like seven thousand people watching her just talk gibberish craziness man so now we have to <laughs> we want to abolish ice abolish cow farts abolish kids insanity man where are we going so she she's saying because of the crazy uh, because of climate change where we're going that we need to question whether we are going to have kids i'm questioning my kids now thank you aoc now now i i, I don't even know if i did the right decision i'm like if the world is gonna end if if, if it's so crazy right 
that the world is going to end in 12 years? I mean, I, I, I don't understand where, where this, this, this crazy amount of this rush, where, where is this coming from that she believes the world is going to end in 12 years, that we need to reconsider even if we're going to have kids, man? This woman, thank God for her, to be honest. Because this is going to be an exciting 20, uh, 2020 presidential um, race. It's going to be crazy. Guys, thank you so much for being with me. Really? You made it to the end of the video? Congratulations. You have no life. Go check out one of my other videos. Sub to the channel. Give me a like. Give me a comment. Check out my other social media, which is Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. I do have a life, so I'm not going to be that active. But follow me on there. God bless. Godspeed. Me, Valentine. I'm out.